And your referee with the action is Rosalie Pereira. And it's time for us to witness what these amazing ladies have. Here we go, round number one. Kareem left from Bois. A red right corner and... Oh, they went hard already, huh? Yeah. No time for study. Right, Cyrus, they're all in action right now. Round number one and... Action right off the bat. You got a fumble. Yeah, Steve, I've been telling everybody since I saw that Manon was on this card. We know what Corinne can do because we've right. seen her. But I've seen Manon down in South Africa for EFC where I work. And she is next level striker. Like some of the stuff you'll see uh, will really surprise you. I mean, we're talking like some flying knees. We're talking spinning kicks. We're talking all that good stuff, you know. Right. So. And it's always good to see that we got women's division in the UAE Warriors, and especially for this position now. Sure. You know, a lot of people are saying, oh, yeah, you know, women can't really fight. But, you know, ah, bro. a lot has <laughs> been happening in the past 10 years. Oh, my goodness. It's you know? come leaps and bounds. Right. It took a while for it to get to the Middle East, right? But sure. now that it's here, they're really embracing it. You know, it's, it's right. fantastic. Referee Rosie now is uh, wanting for some more action right here in the clinch as Manon is pushing the pace. They're aggressive right here in the first round. Stop. And, and they're going to reset. So here we go. And, and Corinne, listen, Corinne's good in the clinch. She has right. great clinch work. She has good ground game as well. Uh, Manon, if that's any problem that she has, it'll probably be on the ground. But if right. she can get her distance, watch oh. out. Oh! Oh, Corinne landing some bombs. Oh, little takedown. Wow. How about Corinne Laframbois? She's going to get the takedown. Oh! Very good take down the cage. What do I mean? What can you say? What action here in the first a round? A lot of action. God and this is the women's. These girls division. are putting the show. The women's flyweight division once again. <laughs> now we got to see <laughs> little elbow thrown by. She's Queen. trying to break her posture to avoid ground and pound. He, she was using the elbows. No Firo inside of the guard here. Corinne Laframboise, she's already got those legs up pretty high here, Daniel. Yes. So she has to be careful. So far she's doing a good job. Now she trapped her arm. So she's doing a good job in the battle to don't get damaged, don't get any strike. But still, it's not a very good position to be. And the, and the good thing about our referee here, Rosaline Ferreira, is she is very, very good. And she's watching very closely. And if she's not seeing enough action, she will stand them up. So Yes. There you go. Right, right, on, right on cue, right? She starts a asking for action. These are the type of referees that I like, guys. I like a referee that if they're not seeing anything, there's no advancements, they stand the fight up. Bring it up again. Why if not? If they're on the ground and they're not doing anything, you got to stand them up and, you know, She's doing great. Boss. She's doing a great job breaking his posture. So she just need to hold that a little longer, and the referee being there, they're up. Now, obviously, Daniel. I mean, you you like to operate on the ground. You're I do, of a, course. A, a world level <laughs> world level grappler. Obviously, a champion, man. And uh, Avi, you'd love to stay down there longer and to continue to operate, right? So, yes, I mean, but I, I still prefer be on the top. I yeah. think for me, maybe on the bottle, like any mistakes can cost you. Of course. So okay, let's the see best what idea now. is block, protect your face, try to get a sweep, or try to bring the f stand up again. It's barely a minute and a half left here in the first round of your UAE Warriors women's flyweight division. Still a grand pound happening now. Let's see if Rafa Rose is going to ask him how to stand up. Yeah, a minute left here. As you can see, though, oh. is, she's coming oh. over the top. Manon gets out. And now got that kind of that front face lock position. As you can see, Corinne is, is really driving in here, Daniel, and um, trying to get something going here. But Manon does a really good job of, of keeping her control there. Yes. I think she got the elbow. She's, she's on control, but she's not striking. She's not put any damage. Now she got the back. Oh. Dangerous situation. Very good back take. Let me try to forget a choke. No, Corinne is in trouble. Manu looks very strong, you know. Uh, no, yeah. But now it's just she don't look the like she's game. skinny, but she's so strong. Yeah, she's all muscle. She's yeah, really, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, she kind of came onto the scene. They did a reality show down in South Africa, and they brought her in. I think she had only had two fights at the time, and... 
She ran through everybody. Oh, really? The reality wow. show and then took out the champion. She got the title shot and then beat the champion. I mean, incredible story. Oh, wow. That's awesome. And that is the end of if you can. What a knockout. Yeah. Well, but my started. nose is an amazing striker, so I don't know. Yeah, you know, and Corinne's already shown us some power. She's oh, landed oh. a few shots, but this is where yes. Manon is fun to watch because she's so quick. No, oh, so far I just oh. see Manon better. Oh, they're parting it out right now. Oh, look at that side kick right to the body. No Piro. <laughs> amazing, amazing start. You know, how many times, guys, do you see a female fight on the card, you don't know what to expect, and they steal the show? And so right. far, that's exactly right. what's happening. Yes. Amazing. Although that last knockout was nice. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that not, was a beautiful KO. Not, not taking anything from Anasi Rajmanir, though. I mean, that was a great one. What first a round, first gorgeous round. KO, man. Manu got the takedown again. She, she looks like well-rounded. She's very good striker. She got good takedowns, good control on the floor. I always think it's impressive any fighter that comes out of France because MMA, as far as having shows, has yeah. been outlawed for years. And I think right. they've just now lifted that within the last year or so. They have to literally go somewhere else to fight train. all their fights. Yeah. Well, they can train, but they can't fight. actually fight. Yeah, so, I mean, it's it's really interesting, you know. There's a lot of kickboxing going on there, a lot of everything else, but MMA, they've always deemed too brutal. Right. Now they finally lifted that so they can actually do shows in France now, but um, yeah, it's but crazy. Look, yeah, it's, it's, it's paid off. So they're so used to traveling. They're so used to being, you know, in somebody else's backyard, you know right. what I mean, which right. I think is an advantage. Hook her leg, hook her leg. No, don't let her no, no, no. Once again, just kind of... Manu is keeping the pressure, keeping, oh, using the knees. Extremely well-rounded is Fiorel. She's don't stop. She's busy the whole time. Yes, yes. Don't let her hook. And I believe both fighters still pretty young in their careers as far as age as well. So, I mean, really the ceiling for these two uh, high. could be, yeah, could be very, very high. And I see Manon Firo not only doing well here, but I see her maybe going even further and doing yeah. some bang with the UFC. I mean, that's, right. She's got that sort of talent level, I believe. And her aggressiveness is just off the charts. You know, she's pushing the pace in round number one, and here we go, round number two once again. And referee Rosie says, I want some action. Yeah. Nope. And here we go. She's becoming my favorite referee. <laughs> and I know Blake really, really well. I think she was still oh. working, but. Corinne, oh, though, good. showing that power again. I mean, you got to watch out for that right hand. Yeah. You know what I say? All it takes is just one punch. It's the best part of MMA. Those are small gloves, man. Four ounce gloves. Right. But they sting, and they sting really bad. <laughs> oh! Oh, the ladies are putting on a clinic here at the Jiu Jitsu Arena here in Abu Dhabi. We see Karina ready right now. Another kick by Nan. These ladies are just putting on a show. Wow. No, Corinne's an amazing athlete, too. She's. Her coach is Fabio Landa, a very good friend, great Jiu Jitsu guy, so. She's not here to play. She's just having a hard time to find her, her momentum. As Manu looking better. Right. And Manon has been very good at moving so far. I mean, she's trying to avoid all the strikes from Karina. It's been effective so far. She never had a really a significant strike landed by Karina to her. Corinne chasing her down. She, you know, she's almost showing that urgency that she knows she has to score, right? She right. knows that she's been outpointed yes. thus far. And I love that urgency from a fighter. A lot of the times you're like, come on, you're losing. Give me something more. She is trying, but she's having such a hard time getting Manon down. Uh, she's got too good a balance, too good a takedown defense, and Manon's and back big, on top again. And the and big fat Manon, she don't stop. She keep moving around, like, her which make hard for her. Conditioning is just supremely good. I can tell and that she is a strong physical specimen. Yes. For a woman in a flyweight division. Yeah, you're absolutely right. She don't stop. She can kick. She can punch. She can wrestle. She can fight on the floor. Very good fight. Very impressed. I'd probably not even stand a chance with her. No, no, you wouldn't. No, <laughs> She's got the know. mouth, she got the back again. Oh, this She's, thing might be over, Manon. She's partying on. She's partying on. She's 
and Corinne is hanging in there, but she is beaten and bloodied. Manon Firo looking to finish this fight. Corinne Laframbois hanging in there. She is really oh. tough. Wow. Very tough. Her Amazing. Like, if there's one thing that we know about Corinne, it's her heart. She got a lot of heart. Yeah, a lot she's of heart really shown it. Oh! And that could be frustrating for a fighter like Mano, who thought she was really close to ending that fight. She can't put her away yet. Wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> Amazing. Great goal to Abu Dhabi. No. An hour and a half drive. I have to take a test and show it to the border. So that's how we take care of the health. It's so of the tight. People. It's so very, very tight here. And, and we I think love it. Uh, the U.S. could learn a few lessons, uh, to be honest with you. The whole world, the whole world can learn. Should You're learn right. from us. Absolutely right. <laughs> so here we go. Yeah, back to the, to the back fight to right the now. Yes, Third sir. and final round. I look at Corinne. I mean, this is what we expect out of her. She's going to bring the fight. She knows she probably didn't win that round either. So she has to finish the fight. And she's bringing it. She's a bloody mess, but look at her. You know, we're talking about heart. Heart over height, because obviously Manana's still taller than her. Yeah. But see what happens right now. So, so far, this is, this is the best fight so far, right? I mean, this is kind of taking the cake so far. Yes, sir. Oh. We still got two world title fights, man. That, that's the exciting oh, yes. part about it, right? <laughs> and we got Usman Nurmagomedov in the house looking to stay undefeated. So you got to watch that as well. Khabib is going to be in his corner. So, man, oh, MMA great, royalty. Great things to come still. What a great night. I think Kareem's nose is broken from, from the angle that I'm seeing. Maybe it's a cut. I'm not sure. Kind of killed it to the right side. Yes. But she's, she's just keep going. What a warrior. Yeah. These ladies are amazing. Some great yes, camps up there in Montreal, Canada. Obviously, when you think Canada, you think of your George St. Pierre, your Rory McDonald's. But there are so many great fighters so many up there great in fighters. Canada. Yeah, it's a hotbed. Yeah. Well, so far, if you're going to ask me to find a fight of the night. Yeah, no, you're right. Oh, yeah. So far. Ooh, right to, you know, it's the she times it just perfect, you know, Daniel. I mean, when she lands her shots, the momentum's there, short shots. Yeah, that nose doesn't have a chance. That's going to take some reconstruction, I think, after the fight. She's being more technical, smarter. She's finding her momentum. She's using her reach. She's longer. Little combo there by Manol Firo. Ren is... Looking for the, the big hit shot there. One hitter quitter. Wow. Nan is just on a different level with her strike in the ground game. Yeah, they, it, she's keep moving. It's very hard to read her. She keep moving back, forward, around. Right. Throw punches, kicks. And she can play counter puncher and she can be the aggressive as well. And she can take you down as well, so. Ah, yeah, Kareem, Kareem is never stopping. Ah, I mean, she gets Kareem is very tough. She's like a pit bull, man. She just keeps going forward and a lot of credit for her. Definition of a warrior, my friend. Oh, yes, it is, it is. Oh, baby. Goodness gracious, what how much, a combo. How much more damage can Kareem endure in this fight? I don't know. You know, and then Mano being a southpaw, being a lefty, that's so so much other challenges that go with that. And, oh wow! Yeah. Oh, that nose is destroyed. It's destroyed. Yeah. The, oh. The nose look broke, but what impressed me is like she's not even feeling. She just keep going forward. Look at her. You don't forward. see her complaining or or stopping. What a warrior! Oh wow! And, and you know, the referee is watching very very closely. If she takes too much. You know, uh, unguarded shots there to that base. Rose will stop the fight. Stop the fight yeah. Yeah, but yeah. she's but still, she's, man, she's showing so much heart, though, you know. So that's her job. You gotta let this thing go, I think. You, know, you gotta give props to Korea for, you know, just withstanding all this punishment that she's getting right now. A little over oh. a minute. Oh! Golly, another big left hand. Those left straights are on the money. That is her power punch. She keeps teasing the head kick and just misses. But if she lands it, it's good night. Let's go. Let's go. Everything off. All on lockdown. Let's go. The only way Green can win this match is if she, you know, drops a big one and knocks her out. Let's go. So far, it's been a total domination. Let's go. Last try. 30 seconds. Let's go. Oh, and here we go. They're going to have to shut it down. Manofi Rowe looking to end this fight. Oh! My 
my goodness. She keeps her balance. She's gonna pull oh, away. there we go. There we go, the fight is tight. I'm Fair telling you. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Rosalie Panetta stops the fight at 432, round number three. Your winner by TKO to the strikes, Mano!